Welcome to Johnston County, otherwise known as Joko. We're really excited to be exploring this county just south of Raleigh for the next three days. Back in 2004, when we first moved to the States for teaching, I was placed in this little school in a town called Smithfield that I'd never heard of before, but it was in Johnston County. And that was the beginning to our story, which led us here with our travel blog, living in America and loving the lifestyle so much. So we're excited to share with you what we love so much about this region that's well known for its grace, good manners and gentle way of living. Downtown Clayton is a really great place to explore. I'm sitting in the community garden, which is a very tranquil spot. There's the sculptural art trail, which features new artists every year, and the sculptures are scattered throughout downtown. And there's some amazing boutique shopping as well. Don't miss Three Little Birds. It's one of the coolest stores we've seen in a long time. I have found my new favorite store in downtown Clayton. It's called Three Little Birds. It is three levels of local awesomeness. So there's about 70 local artists that um, bring their artwork here. There's incredible signs, clothes, jewelry. It is super cool. We came in here for a look. We're walking out with a t-shirt and an awesome North Carolina sign for our RV and our home. This is such a groovy place. Make sure you check it when you're in downtown Clayton. Now get your coffee, beer and wine from Boulevard and have a nice chicken salad lunch at Nancy Joe's Bakery. Just be sure to bring your ambling pace and your smiles because the people here are real friendly y'all. In downtown Benson, make sure you spend a bit of time browsing the stores. Stop in to Dixie Divas for some really cool cowgirl boots. JP's Pastry is where you want to go for those sweet treats. Cupcake anyone? A red velvet cupcake? A gluten-free red velvet cupcake? Yes, if you have any gluten-free challenges and you know how difficult it is to get something yummy and a great treat for you, we'll come down to Benson. JP's Pastry, we've just spent a bit of time in here checking out the facility. These delicious treats are distributed um, across the South uh, East. If you visit Whole Foods, you have probably seen his baked goods. So we are super excited to be able to eat this. Oh my God, that's so good. Cut. I just want to eat now, it's delicious. I wish I had a coffee to go with it. And Cornerstone Cafe Coffee is a good place for dinner and for coffee of a morning as well. The Hampton Inn and Suites is a great place to stay and do not miss salvaged heirlooms for a bit of vintage shopping and some avocado toast beer. So this is avocado toast ale, um, 8% from Holly Springs, North Carolina and it is an all female brewery. The, oh, yeah. the only female brewery in the first female brewery in in the state or the country in the state. So cheers to I love my avocados and I love my avocado toast. So interesting. What's it taste like? Avocado. Avocado. <laughs> <laughs> I want some. Beer. Eight percent. Knock yourself out. <laughs> 